So missing man formation is typically for fighter aircraft and they make a sort of a, a V formation, if you will. Uh, and the wingman closest to the, the flight lead on the right, the number three um, position, will pull uh, back on the stick and, and climb straight upward into the sky, symbolizing um, a, a farewell to a, a lost wingman. When we found out about Colonel Doherty, we were uh, excited to have this opportunity uh, and honored that we uh, got to uh, serve him and his family uh, in this manner. When you look at his life of service uh, over the course of 30 years, his uh, status as a POW during the Korean War, uh, the fact that he led the squadron during the, the Vietnam War, uh, he's one of those giants that we stand on uh, and we stand on his shoulders today. It's, uh, it's truly humbling and, uh, and a great honor to be part of such an amazing organization like the 391st Fighter Squadron, both uh, the ops and the maintenance side. Uh, a great group of uh, professionals uh, who come to work every day, uh, give it their all, and, um, and there's not a finer group. From the honor guard to those in attendance to coordinate the flyover, uh, everything that happens, uh, whoever, whenever we're honoring someone, um, a former airman, especially a former gunfighter for us, uh, it just represents the importance of that, um, of honoring their legacy, of honoring their service. We can't pay people more money, we can't give them more time off, but we can honor them for the sacrifice and service.